10 Reasons Why Leah Ash Can't Stand Sis vs. Bro Before we start, I would like you to hit that red subscribe button so that you never miss out on any of our videos. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Roblox Entice. Sis vs. Bro is a YouTube channel run by siblings Ronald and Katrina. The channel is massively popular, which can be judged by the 10 million subscribers the pair has managed to garner, and the channel is still growing. Leah Ash is a Roblox YouTuber who has several times professed her disdain for the sibling pair due to many of the reasons you and I have also failed while watching them. Let's take a look at 10 of those reasons as to why Leah Ash has publicly announced that she can't stand Sis vs Bro. Leah hates clickbait. The pair rely on clickbait for their millions of viewers they're able to get on every single one of their videos, and Lee just can't stand it. Sis vs Bro features videos the likes of what happens when you add bleach to Coca-Cola, and Leah said in her video that it is a surefire way to prove how ridiculous their content is and would not get any acknowledgement without these cheap tricks. Parents as directors. Kat and Ron are too young and arguably too naive to produce and edit their own videos. It is no secret that the channel was the idea of their parents and they manage every bit of it. Leah is pissed off at the idea that the kids owe their popularity to their parents, but despite putting in no effort whatsoever, they manage to make more than $4,000 a day. Leah cannot stand the fact that creators like herself work so hard to earn the fame they possess, but Sisvers Bro is thriving with zero input from the kids themselves. Conscious capitalism. Yes, you read that right. The channel is making millions by spoiling children. Kat and Ron display extremely bratty behavior in their video, and Leah hasn't held back in calling them out for that. In one of their videos, Kat manipulates her dad into buying her a puppy, telling them that the cute pets get more views. Their ideas are mostly stolen as the pair doesn't hesitate to ride the ongoing trends and the messages that they send across mindlessly. No wonder Leah hates them so much. Biggest boasters ever. Half of Sis vs. Bro's videos show nothing but the kids flexing on how much money they have. The siblings have done more than seven house already and own dozens of spacious mentions which you will never hear the end of. They boast about professional saunas and the latest technological gadgets. What makes Leah hate these kids is the fact that in her opinion they are some of the biggest ingrates ever. Despite all these luxuries, they were seen complaining about how their pool was too shallow compared to their friends. Cannot act their age. The children are precocious and act over their age all the time. Katrina has been seen wearing chokers to school, which make her appear older than 13, which is her actual age. On the other hand, Ron uses words like vengeance more than a child's playfulness would excuse. The kids are always unsupervised in their videos, and the parents seem to have no control over their actions. Leah thinks it's bad for the kids as well as their audience, and therefore doesn't like this quality in the siblings either. I need this controller here. Okay. Their jokes don't slap. The humor in the videos of Sis vs. Bro is awful, according to Lee Ash. She says that the videos feature no punchlines whatsoever and are filled to the brim with nonsensical banters and annoying giggles. She is baffled at the fact that even though the videos are scripted, the content is still so bad that she can't stand watching it for more than 5 minutes. Redundant videos Unnecessarily long videos with pilfered ideas from other creators that they pass as their own, Sis vs Bro lack originality, and Leah can't say it non-bluntly. She points out that the length of their videos is long for no reason, and the siblings repeat their challenges from the past so often. She doesn't like the fact that even with no creativity, they keep rolling in big bucks and the audience keeps placing them on this pedestal for apparently no reason at all. The Sis vs Bro fanbase is mean. The fans display similar behavior of insensitivity in the comments section that the siblings do nothing about. They refute any opinions that go in the other directions from what they're saying. They show disrespect to others and the siblings have never addressed the issue because all they care about is apparently the views and the money. Leah deplores this sort of character and has repeatedly told so in her videos. Ostentatious little brats? The kids play games for actual money, and if you're thinking 20 bucks, think bigger. The siblings have a mystery wheel full of crazy bets and have spent more than 1000 and $500 on a single bet. Leah thinks that flaunting cash is such a harmful thing for the kids and the audience who are likely to imitate said behavior. Worst influencers. Leah believes that if you as a parent let your kids watch Sis vs Bro, it'll be the worst parenting move you could make. Their videos are full of stuff that are absolutely toxic for a kid's personal growth. How to convince your parents to buy you stuff. Dad says yes to everything the kids say for 24 hours are a few examples to support Leah's arguments. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are currently on your screen, because I am sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.